Hey, what's up, guys? Back with another video. This video, I'll be going over the topic God resists the proud and gives grace to the humble. So let's just get so in James chapter 4, verse 6, it says that God resists the proud and gives grace to the humble. This is this means that that God won't doesn't deal, doesn't God doesn't like the people that are prideful, arrogant, thinking that they're better than other people. But God gives grace to the humble, so they aren't prideful, arrogant, and they and the humble takes accountability, and and the and the humble are the are the people that are just you know you know just humble, and so we have to be humble and we have to humble ourselves. Let's say you're coming to the truth, and knowledge is puffing you up. You just gotta you just gotta humble yourself because because the knowledge and puffs up even in the Bible it says it. We have to be. We have to humble ourselves, and I think the knowledge puffed me up back then. But I had to. But I have to be humble, and we have to be humble ourselves. And stay humble. Humble yourselves, or God will humble you. And I feel. I felt like God had to humble me. And but like back then, I wasn't. I was just. It's just that. I, it's just that I wasn't really like that humble back then. But it was more like, like with the, with the things that had, like a car or something like that. But like, it, that doesn't, but the cars thing, cars, houses, material stuff, don't, those doesn't really matter anymore. Because it's just vain. Because just the matrix stuff. But I was, but it's good to have a car so you can go around and you can drive. And two cars so you can use one of the cars. So the other person could go to work, and then the other car he can leave the house and do, but and do something, and like maybe go somewhere where you have to go. But if you can't go somewhere where you have to go because you don't have a car, and you only got one car, but the other person in the in your house is probably using it. If in case if you live still with your parents. Okay, so the main main message of this video is to stay humble, guys, and don't let the knowledge puff you up, and and. And, 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 repent of your sins. Just repent of your sins. And thank you guys for watching. <laughs> thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.